NCAA National Championship game is sponsored by Yamaha. We make the difference. Back at halftime with Texas leading at the halfway mark, and we have with us two coaches. Joan Bombasini, who is the head coach of Cal State Fullerton, and Pat Summit, the head coach of Tennessee. And Pat, she was in the Final Four. Let me have your analysis of the first half. Well, I think the big difference has been on the boards. I think that Texas has done a great job controlling the boards. They've only given Southern Cal one shot. And the other thing, I think the bench. Most people think that Texas might have the best team in the country on the bench, and they do have a great basketball team coming off the bench. Joe, and I introduced you wrong. I got your name right. I've been practicing Bon Bassini all year, but it's Cal State Long Beach. It's right. down at Cal State Fullerton. What are your thoughts about the first half? Well, I think Cheryl Miller needs to get the ball more, and she needs to be more selfish. She's been so unselfish in the first half, but as Pat said, it's he is rebounding. I also think that they are very stagnant in their half-court offense, and they need to get more movement on offense, and they need to get more point production from other players, especially Sherry Nelson. She's been putting the ball on the floor too much and I think she needs to be much more involved. Well, Mimi Griffin is the other part of our broadcast team. I'm really surrounded with talent here today. She has some thoughts on some other stars in women's basketball. Shortly, women's basketball will say goodbye to many fine seniors, players who have made an impact on team and fan alike. We'll miss classy Teresa Edwards, the All-American and Olympic gold medalist from Georgia, and Wanda Ford of Drake. And of course, the great CM. But new stars will emerge, and here's just a few. Mercedes-Benz was building sports sedans before there was such a term as sports sedan. Experience pays. The Mercedes-Benz 190 class. The heart of a sports sedan. The soul of a Mercedes-Benz. The 190 class. Something more than a sports sedan. Nothing less than a Mercedes-Benz. AT&T is in customer satisfaction. Our people help Pillsbury design a feedback line using AT&T 800 service. Can I freeze the cupcakes? I 500 calls come in every day, which makes Pillsbury very happy because satisfied customers come back for more. We can help your business in ways you never thought of. AT&T long distance services. Talk with us. AT&T, the right choice. Winning, it's easy. Give 110%, expect 110%. From yourself, everyone, everything. Speed stick deodorant gives 110%. That's its edge. Why? It has no alcohol, and alcohol evaporates. Speed stick protection doesn't evaporate even after 24 hours. Glides on in just a few strokes. That's 110% protection. Speed stick deodorant, the wide stick. That's your edge. By Menon. The fastest runners in the United States were my teammates. And to be motivated to run against them every day, knowing that if you were not your very best, that you could stand to lose at any time, was something to behold on a team like uh, the Tiger Bells of Tennessee State University. Athletics played uh, a big part of the decision for me to go to college. Uh, I, as a young girl coming from this very large, wonderful family of 22 children, 
uh, being the first of the 22 to go to college, it was very important that uh, I get there. I didn't have the slightest idea how we go to college because we had no money. But then athletics popped up. Without the athletics, uh, I would not have obtained the education. And without uh, uh, the education part, I would not be able to do the things that I do now. This message furnished by the NCAA. Texas by 10 at the halfway point, 45-35. Let's go back in history now, women's basketball, a remarkable story in the 70s. Let's look at it. By the early 1970s, Bill Walton and company had firmly established UCLA as one of sports' greatest dynasties. And the Wizard of Westwood, John Wooden, was college basketball's king. But 3,000 miles away, just outside of Philadelphia, a tiny Catholic college named Immaculata was quietly building a reputation of its own. The architect was Kathy Rush, and her teams were so successful that lofty comparisons were inevitable. From 72 through 74, the Mighty Max rolled over the best. Their run and gun offense produced 35 straight wins and three consecutive national titles. I think the impact that Immaculata had was different than the impact that UCLA had because of the timing. We were pioneers. We were, were limited financially. And UCLA sort of came in the middle of the history of men's basketball. Three pioneers have remained prominent today in women's basketball. Rene Muth at Penn State. Mary Ann Crawford coaches Old Dominion. And Teresa Shank leads Rutgers. And even when on opposite ends of the court, they agree on what made Immaculata great. The team itself was very smart, obviously, and we were very, very patient, and we knew we were drilled well. We practiced double sessions before anybody even heard about some double sessions, and Kathy Rush made us do an awful lot to be the champions. We all were individuals who were highly motivated, uh, willing to sacrifice and, and do anything to reach our goals, and uh, we're doing that at a time when it wasn't necessarily the traditional thing to do, and, and that's a great source of pride for me. Not much about the Mighty Max was traditional, from their publicity to their fans. An unusual collection of parents, friends, and nuns who followed the team religiously. They called themselves a bucket brigade and wore their school spirit like a badge of honor. You know, I'm not a basketball player. I never missed a game. I couldn't tell you about good things about a particular play and so on. But I was up there booing at the refs and cheering on the good calls, you know. Uh, and I think we were all there. Just, it just gave us a whole new dimension in our, our life. And I, I think about giving to others, well, that was the time when we were receiving. I was so impressed because here were people who had certainly dedicated their lives to the service of others, and yet my mind playing basketball was just such a trivial thing and being part of that whole thing. I was able to bring such excitement and joy to someone else's life. They're very good friends because I think they're very special people, and I think when Immaculata Basketball, that's what I think of. A special team, the Mighty Max of Immaculata College. Here at Hewlett Packard, we believe that the best way to solve your business computing problem is to make it our problem. Because we know that whatever system we design for your company, we're going to live with it too. We never stop asking, what if? Wait a minute. They have this incredible backlog of data requests. You're right. What if we used the... His name's Lightning. When you want a loan, most banks work at a slow trot. But someone can put you in the saddle. Hop on! The boss at Beneficial. Hi, I'm Carol. Our manager can get you a Beneficial credit line account, usually in 24 hours. The money you want for the things you want. And that was fast. Fast as lightning. You bet. Beneficial. Talk to the manager and you're talking to the boss. Night, lights, rain. You know the feeling, wondering if you could stop if you had to. But now there's Arcot, Bridgestone's surprising Arcot S371 radio. A tire that doesn't compromise in mileage or performance or stopping power. There's never been a tire like it. Arcot, patented by Bridgestone, where new ideas take hold. Call 1-800-453-9000. is a revolutionary advancement in shaving from Gillette Research. The brush Gillette announces Brush Plus. 
a shaving concentrate and brush in one. A brush to lift your whiskers with the soothing warmth only a brush can give you. A concentrate with extra softeners and lubricants that are massaged deep into your beard. Or a shave that is superior. Brush Plus from Gillette for a superior shave. I don't know what I'd do without my teammates and coaches to support me. So often we're pressured by others to do things we really don't want to, like drugs and drinking. I feel fortunate to have friends who back me up when I say no. Sometimes it's not easy to say no, but at all times it's important to say no to drugs and no to irresponsible drinking. With my friends behind me, I've got a lot of good times ahead. You will too, if you can stand up to the pressure. After all, you can't be a hit when you're high. Something to think about from the NCAA. The Lady Longhorns with a 10-point, half-point lead, 45-35 over USC. And let's analyze this first half, Mimi Griffin. One thing is very evident, USC not doing a good job in the rebounding department. No, they're not at all. The deficit is 10 rebounds for Texas over USC right now. The rebounding is important because Texas is able to run their transition game off their rebounds. I think one of the big stories is Cheryl Miller. It's always a big story when she plays, and she is really having a difficult time shooting from the field. One of the things I don't understand, Gary, early on they had Cheryl posted low, and it was very effective for them. Now, all of a sudden, she's playing perimeter basketball. She's taking 15 to 20-foot shots off of picks, and the only reason she has any, not any points, but one of the main reasons is because of the foul she's able to draw. They need her inside, both scoring-wise and rebounding-wise. I thought Cammy Etheridge had a good first half. Yeah, Cammie Etheridge had a great first half. One of the surprising statistics that I noticed, she has five rebounds. She's one of the leading rebounders in the first half. She has eight assists, which is her game average. And then the bench of Kara Pretty coming off doing such a good job. CBS Sports coverage of the NCAA Basketball Championship will continue after this message and a word from your local station. is also the biggest bargain airline. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, United Airlines announces low fares to more of this land than anybody. All brought to you by yours truly, Eddie Hummel. Low fares with full service to over 150 cities coast to coast. You're not just flying, you're flying the friendly skies. This is CBS. Special guest host Gladys Knight welcomes Boy George with Culture Club and Barry Manilow on Solid Gold. Solid Gold, tonight at 10.30 on Channel 7. Always leaving home to play sports isn't easy. That's why so many Austin families have a sport court in their backyard. When family and friends gather on a sport court, there are no schedules to juggle, no reservations to make. You'll be having fun and getting the exercise you need right at home in your own backyard. So call Sport Court today and let them build some fun into your home. Basketball, volleyball, paddle tennis, and more. You'll join the lineup for family fun. And everybody gets into the act. The 1986 Women's NCAA National Championship Game is sponsored by Nissan, who invites you to test drive the all-new Nissan truck hard bodies at your Nissan Datsun dealer now. Sears. And by Michelob Light, super premium taste and less filling beer. Ready to begin the second half. We talked about one of the trademarks of Texas, their bench. And look at the people involved offensively. Davis leading the way, but Harris and Williams with eight. 